At night she moved as a shadow behind the shoji door, partly opened in hypnagogia, as if she were a hypnotized puppet, sleepwalking in a bunraku play, controlled by stagehands to move just beyond my reach, with her feet shuffling like cards, bridged and whispers between. But I slowly awoke with her moving closer, frame by frame, till she sat just in front of me with her hands brushing a grass grip poem in the empty air, billowing in the breeze as the breath of the beyond on my lips. And when the last word was spoken, we sat silently together in memory as the picture-perfect stillness of a photograph.